If you just finished the installation of SharePoint, you would have already been to the farm configuration screen. I've backed out. I went straight to the central administration. That's where I want to start at. If you want to get to the central administration page, you click Start, All Programs, SharePoint 2013 Products, and the central administration link is here. In the main page of central administration, click the configura configuration wizard, launch the farm configuration wizard, and then start it. Now I'm not going to advocate right out of the gates of using existing managed accounts. I already have a new domain account created called SP App Service, and we'll leverage that one. We will install everything with the exception of Lotus Notes Connector. This isn't the normal way that you should do it. Uh, we'll get into these in more detail later on in future tutorials uh, for each one specifically. For example, Performance Point does not, uh, should not be used in the same service account as the other ones. Go ahead and click Next. The wizards finish. Now we're going to start with our first site. We'll just create a simple site here. Name it Demo. Make it a subsite, and we'll make it a publishing portal. Click OK. Sorry, I forgot the URL there. And now we've finished the new site. I've gone ahead and, and uh, opened it up. Here's a sample what the site looks like. You can verify it by the URL. And here is a list of all the services which were installed. I brought up SQL Server Management Studio because I wanted to illustrate all the databases which are installed behind those applications. And we're going to get into those again more uh, later as we get in further into the tutorials. But if you recall from our previous tutorials, some of the uh, databases that we had before was uh, the SharePoint admin content, config, uh, WSS content. So everything else is relatively new with uh, a couple other exceptions here, reporting services. So that's it for the farm configuration wizard. You now have uh, your first site up. You can go back into the central administration. You could manage your uh, services for the farm. You can also uh, manage additional sites. Thank you for watching. If you like what you've seen, don't forget to subscribe down below. And uh, stay tuned. We'll bring more tutorials as uh, time permits. Thank you.